everybody welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is if you are a first time viewer if this your first time make sure you subscribe to my channel join the family join the game and yeah we're just gonna get it popping so this video is gonna be a highly like highly requested video i get so many people act like so many people ask me like I want to do makeup, I want to start doing makeup, but I don't know like what to get or what I need to start off with. So in this video, basically I'm going to show you the things that you will need to start off doing makeup with. Like, these products I'm about to show y'all are basically just like the starter pack. Like this is basically the, you feel me, I'm just going to do me a full face, like nothing too extravagant. But you can do your full face. Like I'm just like you. I was watching YouTube videos. I'm like, okay, I want to do makeup. So I'm finna, you feel me? I didn't even know what to get. So I'm like, I'm finna watch YouTube videos and I'm finna figure all this out. So I was watching YouTube videos. Boom. Then one day, it was at night. Me and my twin, I decided, let's go to Walgreens. So me and my twin went to Walgreens and I just started picking up everything. Like I just started picking stuff up. So my twin was like, you finna spend all your money on makeup? You still Those are her exact words. And I promise y'all, every time I do makeup, I do a face or something, I'm like, remember you told me I was stupid for buying all this makeup? She be like, girl, it's just, you spend all that money on that. Now look at me. Ha. Twin, if you watching this, I ain't sneak this because I'm talking about you. But anyway, I love my twin. But anyway, so boom, that's how I start. And that night, I actually did a face. And y'all, it was terrible. But of course, I thought it was cute because it was my first time doing a face again, but it was terrible. But anyway, that's how I started doing makeup. I was watching YouTube. Then I went to Walgreens one night, bought hella makeup. Like, I spent so much money on makeup and I didn't even know how to do it. I was just spent it. I'm so impossible, but anyway, now I'm here. <laughs> so yeah, so. Now I'm about to tell you guys what you could do, what you need to start doing makeup. First things first, you will need, and then I got everything over here, so if I keep reaching this one. So first things first, when you want to do makeup, you will need makeup wipes. Makeup. Makeup wipes. Okay, so yeah, you will need makeup wipes, like you're gonna need makeup wipes. Plus, when you're done and before you do your face, you gotta wipe your face with the makeup wipes. I got these from Walmart. So, you can go to Walmart and get makeup wipes. As a beginner, doing eyebrows, you should use the eyebrow pencil. That's how I started off. I started off using the eyebrow pencil because I feel like pomade and like gel is for like once you've been doing makeup and like you get the feel of it, then you can upgrade to like eyebrow pomade. More for intermediate. And like people that actually, I'm not gonna say people that know what they're doing, that people, but people that have been doing it. But if you're a beginner, I suggest you starting off with an eyebrow pencil. And these could be at your local beauty supply, Walgreens, Walmart, eyebrow pencil. Um, get it in shade, whatever shade you want your eyebrows in. I usually do black or brown. That's it. So eyebrow pencil, eyeshadow. You will need eyeshadow palettes. And I'm showing y'all these ones. I have like more, I'm not gonna say better, but I have like more brandy, brandy, brandy eyeshadow palettes, but I'm just showing beginners. Like this is for beginners. You can go to the beauty supply. As a beginner, I don't think you should order like a Morphe palette and stuff like that because what if you feel like, okay, Makeup, not my thing, you get me? Yeah, but you just spent all this money on like a Morphe palette and them expensive. So before you go spend all your money on expensive palettes, just start off small with just some eyeshadow palettes. And I got these. Eyeshadow palette, you're gonna need like eyeshadow brushes. So you're gonna need like small like brushes for your eyeshadow. I would just do all my brushes. You're gonna need eyeshadow brushes. Those are like brushes like these. Like the small fluffy brushes for your eyeshadow. You're gonna need them because you can't put eyeshadow on with your fingers. Or well, you can, but it's gonna be messy and all and all that. So yeah. I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> um uh, you also gonna probably yeah, you're gonna need this. It's a spoolie, and this is to like 
brush your eyebrows and like why is i'm steady saying logic let me stop saying logic starting now <laughs> you're gonna need the eyebrow spoolie this is to like <laughs> okay do it oh my god i can't this do it. is the eyebrow spoolie this is to brush your eyebrows in place before you use the um before you use the eyebrow pencil. Before you do your eyebrows, you gotta brush them in place with the eyebrow spoolie. So you need this. So I showed you the eyeshadow brushes already. Um, you're gonna need a foundation brush. Foundation brush. This is what I use for my foundation. It's like, it looks like this. It's, it's called a face brush. That's what it's called. A face brush. I got this from Walmart. It came in like a pack with like five other brushes but those brushes not really a sense you really don't need them but you're gonna need a foundation brush because you can't put foundation on without a foundation brush boom so at the foundation you're going to need you're gonna need um like like an angle i really don't know what the name of this brush is but you're gonna need like a brush like this and this is to conceal your eyebrows once you feel your eyebrows in, you're gonna need a brush like this or an angle brush like this to conceal your eyebrows, clean up the, clean them up, clean them up. So you're gonna need this brush. Once you're done concealing your eyebrows with this brush, you're gonna need a small fluffy brush, but not like your eyeshadow brushes. This one is more like firm. Um, This one is called a crease brush, but I used it to like, I was doing so good. I was doing so good not saying like, but it's okay. Okay, so after you do, after you clean your eyebrows, you're gonna use this brush to like, <sighs> after you clean your eyebrows, you're gonna use this brush to bluff it all out. If you get what I'm saying, to like, just to clean it up basically so you're gonna need this to clean up the concealer to make it look more natural and ba and basically just yeah you're gonna need a brush like this i hope i'm explaining this good but this video is just meant to show y'all what you need not meant for me to tell y'all what you need and how to use it so i'm trying to go above and beyond for y'all but i'm done because i keep seeing also you're gonna need an angled brush a fluffy angle brush like this you see how it's angled it's kind of angled this is called a flat face angle brush but just get an angle brush and this is for your contour you're gonna need a brush like this for your highlight this is optional you really don't need this brush for your highlight you could just use your finger and highlight but this is a highlight brush boom boom and last but definitely definitely not least you're gonna just need a big fluffy brush to like blend everything out once you're done like blend your whole face so you won't look all like a puzzle so you will look in sync Blend it all out with this. It's just a fluffy brush. Me, personally, I would get my brush for Amazon. When you go on Amazon, type in makeup brushes. They have sets of brushes. Just go on Amazon. Starting off, because this is what I did. Start off, go on Amazon, type in makeup brushes, and it's going to pop up. And they have sets of makeup brushes, so you won't be buying like one brush. They come with sets of like 20 brushes. You're going to need, in order to do a full face, you're going to need concealer concealer and foundation foundation and concealer so starting off i feel like drugstore foundation i still use drugstore foundation and concealer even though i'm really not a beginner anymore i still use it my favorite um drugstore concealer would be la girl pro so la girl pro as a begin, go get this y'all just go get this you want to start go get this la girl pro you're gonna need concealer but i have other brands too but la girl pro as a beginner and getting concealer you should get a shade that is that is your skin tone and a shade that's one shade lighter than your skin tone for your high foundations you're gonna need foundation 
because you feel me what's makeup without foundation you're gonna need a foundation all these foundations are drugstore foundations so yeah my favorite this is the one i actually first started off with wet and wow wet and well um i was a beginner you feel me this was my first foundation it's not my favorite brand but as a beginner you just practicing it's it's really like inexpensive affordable so boom but my favorite drugstore right now my favorite drugstore foundation would be maybelline uh fit me foundation can y'all ever see that maybelline fit me foundation i still use this so these are like my favorite drugstore foundations now maybelline fit me so you're gonna need foundation boom i feel like i need something to drink i feel like i'm running that up <sighs> okay I talked about the contour brush. You're gonna need contour, like a contour palette. You feel me? This is the one I got. I got this from, I, I actually got, I stole this from my mama. Yeah, I stole this from my mama, but I seen this up in Walmart. So they, everything I'm showing y'all, they have in Walmart, literally. I seen all this up in Walmart. So this basically all drugstore makeup. So you need, this is the True Complexion Contour Palette. You need a contour palette just to do your contour. You need a highlighter, you feel me? Just to give you that look, that glow. You feel me? Just a glow. Y'all know we like the glow, so you're gonna need the highlighter. They got these at any drugstore. So go get you a highlighter. Boom. It don't gotta be this one. This one's not really all that. I got this like at the beauty supply, so you could just go to the beauty supply, get a highlighter. They got um, a pinkish one, but I just got gold because I like to be I like to be gold, bronzy. You're gonna need setting powder. Setting powder. And I got this one, the Aspen setting powder from Amazon, Airspin from Amazon. I ordered this from Amazon. I really don't use this one as much cause I feel like it make me look lighter. This is the translucent one. It made me look too light, but I use it, but not all the time. And this one is the black radiance one. This is the one I really go to. And I got this one from Walmart. So you need setting powder. And this is just to, when you put the concealer on, like when you conceal your highlighted areas, this is just to make sure the concealer don't crack and all that. Yeah, and that you don't get flashback and stuff like that. So you need this. Cause when you take pictures, you don't want to be looking like a ghost and stuff like that. So get you some setting powder still. So and you, you don't want to be looking all cracked up and like, ugh. Like skin all cracking, that's nasty. Y'all, please don't man this. I got makeup all over it. <laughs> don't man this. It's just at the bottom of my makeup bag. This is the um, face primer. And basically, you could just go to any drugstore and get some face primer. This is just what you put on before you do uh, before you do your makeup. Just to make sure that your makeup stay on longer. And that it really don't sweat as much. Or become as oily like a blade just to clean your eyebrows before you fill them in um you're gonna need lashes i don't have any lashes with me but you don't need lashes but i feel like lashes make every look look better so you're gonna need lashes and then you're gonna need uh, um whew, what the, fuck? the thing I, feel, I hate when i can't remember stuff you're gonna need this to put your lashes on boom and then you're gonna need mascara just to put on after you put your I mean, the glue of course this is not lash glue this is hair glue but i'm ghetto so i use hair glue as my lash glue so yeah you're gonna need the glue to make sure your eyelashes stick and yeah i think i showed y'all everything you need to just do your basic full face now this video has been highly recommended so i just showed y'all what I did, I told y'all what I did when I first started doing makeup and I showed y'all some of the products I got to start doing makeup. I showed y'all exactly what you'll need to just do a basic full face. So just take my advice and run with it. So yeah, thank y'all for watching this video. Make sure y'all give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to reach 1K before my birthday, which is 1227. So please help me y'all. Subscribe to my channel. Help me hit the 1K mark. Comment what y'all think about this video. Comment if it was helpful because I really think I was rambling. Oh, yeah. Make sure that y'all 
follow me on Instagram. My name finna be right here. Follow me on Instagram because that's where it go to hell next. So follow me on Instagram, subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment y'all thoughts, and thank you for watching.